सहनावतु सहनो भुनक्त सह वीर करवाह तेजस्वीनावधी तमस्तुमाषा वह ओ शाति 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 ओ श्रीगणेशा नम ओ श्री सरस्वत नम ओ श्री गुरुभ्यो नम समस्तजनकल्याण निरत करुणाम नमा चिन्म देव सद्गु ब्रह्म विवर पठा संस्कृत नित्यम वदा संस्कृत सदा ध्याया संस्कृत सम्यक वंदे संस्कृत मातर हरिओ लेट स्टार्ट as usual with a subhashita very very beautiful subhashita this is let us chant i will chant please repeat after me kan pracham asura swarge nivasamo vayam bhuvi kim va kavyarasa swaduhu किं वा स्वादयसी सुधा टुगेदर कान पृछा स्वर्गे निवसामो वयम भुवि किं वा काव्यरस स्वादु किं वा स्वादयसी सुधा हा नो वॉट वेरी ब्यूटिफुल द पोएट इज आस्किंग कान पृछा कान to whom prachamah vayam prachamah to whom should we ask what what you want to ask that is that is given in the second line but first he is asking to whom should we ask suraha swarge suraha devatah the deities are in the heaven they stay in the heaven vayam bhuvi nivasamah and we are staying on earth so to whom should we ask किं वा काव्यरस स्वादु इज द पोएट्री टेस्टियर किं वा स्वादयसी सुधा और इज द नेक्टर टेस्टियर सी वॉट वॉट द पोएट इज ट्राइंग टू से हियर ही सेंग दैट देर आर टू ग्रेट थिंग्स वन वी हैव हर्ड अबाउट द लेजेंड ऑफ नेक्टर विच इज ओनली गिवन टू द देवताज इन द इन द हेवन एंड दे से नेक्टर इज द बेस्ट you know uh, drink that you can have and you will become immortal because of that etc etc but on the earth we know of one such great giver of joy and that is kavya poetry now he is saying to whom should we ask what is more tastier whether nectar is more tastier or poetry is more tastier why because those who are enjoying nectar are not able to enjoy kavya rasa which is there on earth and those who are able to enjoy kavya rasa on earth they have not tasted the nectar so that is that is what is the point so basically what is he saying gods live in the heaven and we on the earth whom should we ask what is tastier what he means to say is poetry is as tasty as or rather more tasty as tasty as nectar or tastier than nectar that's the that's the main point now you see here there is another uh, subhashita 
which is very famous which says that uh, those who do not have any interest any ruchi any liking in poetry music etc it is said that they are just like i think we have seen earlier this subhashita isn't it they are not human beings <laughs> they are animals without horns and puch without the tail they are animals only why that's the main thing you must have seen no sometimes this urdu poetry or hindi poetry or sanskrit of course we understand little bit but as we start understanding we will understand what kind of thinkers are there and how they have put this poetry so beautiful hmm? the more we get into it the more rasa starts to come the more enjoyment starts to come so that is what the poet is trying to hint at here that kavya poetry is as tasty as the nectar probably even more tastier than the nectar okay those who get it they get it you can't really force people to like poetry like music like you know these are not the things that you can force somebody to like if you like it you have a good taste they always say you tell me the songs that you like and i will tell you who you are <laughs> isn't it that is true for everything you tell me that the poetry you listen to i will tell you who you are you show me the way you drive and i will tell you who you are what it means is our entire personality is built on all these things these are very very important aspects of our life and today slowly probably what has happened is this has become extra curricular not not part of the education i am i'm sure slowly things are changing in the world and people are coming back to this you know in a in a conventional way as well which is always good but this should be studied this should be studied i am sure you are aware that on our chinfo channel itself chinmay international foundation's youtube channel itself gauri mahulikar ji is taking classes on sunday if you are not please attend it's a brilliant class that she takes weekly i think recently she has started with uh, shakuntalam isn't it recently she has started with kalidas abhidnyana shakuntalam the drama written by kalidasa so please see this this will this is something if you want to learn a language okay we are seeing the grammatical part of the language but the real taste of language comes through poetry through literature okay sometimes they ask veji why don't you take that is not my area you see my area is not that otherwise i would have loved to take all those uh, all those portions of 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 kavya of literature but that is not it should be taken by somebody who is you know expert in that so that's why gauri ji is taking and so please go and listen to all those sessions as well study how the poetry is in sanskrit it will really help in understanding the language all right you can say we are doing the theoretical part of it you know but the beautiful practical part of it is there in the in the poetry all right back to our topic yeah we were seeing the sandhi and last session we started with hal sandhi hal sandhi is what is a venjana sandhi it is a consonant joining with any other letter it can be consonant joining with a vowel or consonant joining with another consonant that is what we we were seeing we saw few sutras hmm? jhalam jashonte and jhalam jash jashi jhalam jashonte is for bahi abhi sandhi jhalam jash jashi is anta sandhi outside the word and inside the word both of them what do they do when c1 c2 c3 c4 is followed by any swara or antastha or c5 or c4 or c3 then c1 c2 c3 c4 is converted into c3 coming to the center remember the changes to the the changes to the the changes to the remember gajada dab it comes to the center jhalam jashonte very important sandhi in in hal sandhi lots of times it is used then we saw one extension jhayo ho anyatarasyam in this if it is followed by her 
then as the first letter changes to C3, her will also change to C4. Extension after Jalam Jashonte is applied, then Jayoho Anyatarasyam. Optionally, Anyatarasyam. Optionally, this also will apply. But as we said, as we saw in the last session, optionally means by rule it is optional, but by practice everybody does it. Right? And therefore, first C1, C2, C3, C4 will get converted to C3 and then her will change to C4. It's C4. Whatever C3 is, has come, it's C4. It will get converted to. We saw one more extension. Yaro anunasike anunasikova. Yaro anunasike anunasikova. What does it do? After this has taken place, if it is followed by C5 out of this, then that C3, which C1, C2, C3, C4 has changed it to C3, that C3 will further change to C5. Okay? So far, have you followed? Huh? Jalam Jashonte, Jalam Jash Jashi converts it into C3. Right? Jayo Vanyatarasyam, optionally her changes to C4. And Yaronu Nasikenu Nasikova, that C3 which it has converted, further converts into C5. Anu Nasika, nasal sound. We have seen the examples also. We have seen everything. Now let us come to the next Next Sandhi Sutra, where it is converted into C1. C1. Let us see the Sutra and then more points I will tell you. Please repeat. Kharicha. 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 Hmm. Now, actually, what is the Sutra telling? It is a Hal Sandhi, Venjana Sandhi, Ubhaya, inside and outside both, Nitya, compulsory. And it is Adesha Sandhi. In place of one thing, another thing is coming. Mostly, mostly all the Sandhis that we are going to see initially are Adesha Sandhis. Agama, Sandhi, etc. We will see after some time. So, what is the Sutra telling? Khari Pare Jhalam Charasyuhu. What? Khari Pare Jhalam Charasyuhu. <coughs> Sorry. So, Khari Pare. When followed by khara, jhala <coughs> changes to chara. Now, what is this jhala? What is khara? <coughs> what is chara? All these things are according to the Maheshwara Sutra. So, what is jhala? Same, C1, C2, C3, C4. What is khara? Kapha chatata chatatao kapai shashasar. Basically C2, C1 and Ushmana, but applicable only for C2, C1. And chara, chara means cha. Kapha chatata over. Chatata kapa. That's it. Chatata kapa. Again, it can go up to shashasar, but it will go only till C1. So, what is happening here? Basically, let us see. Carefully see what I am writing, okay? C1, C2, C3, C4, which is in the Vargaksharas. I hope you remember this, this whole block, right? If this whole block 
is followed by anything on this side, then it will convert into C3. If it is followed by swara, vowels, antastha, semi-vowels, C3, C4, then it will convert to C3. If it is followed by C5, then C3 and then C5. See, first this will also apply. But I am writing directly the final. Yaron nasike nu nasikova. Final answer will be C5. But if it is followed by the previous ones, it will get converted to C1. So you can imagine something like this. Create a division in the center. If it is followed by the latter portion, it will get converted into latter portion. So if it is followed by C3, C4, it will get converted to C3. If it is followed by C5, it will also get converted to C5. And if it is followed by former one, then it will get converted to C1. Right? Column 1, 3, 5. Either it will get converted to 3 or 5 or 1. 3, Jalam Jashwante, Jalam Jash Jashi. 5, Yaron Nasike Anu Nasikova, Anu Nasika Sandhi. And C1 is this Kharicha. So what is happening here? What is happening here? C1, 2, 3, 4 followed by C1 or C2. That C1, 2, 3, 4 is converting itself into C1. When we see the examples, you will understand what is happening. What is happening? Dig palaha becomes dig palaha. Okay. Dig, dig, g is C3. Ka, kha, ga. That C3 is followed by p, which is C1. Pa, pha, ba. When C3 is followed by C1, C3 also will convert itself into C1. Dikpalaha. Understanding? Very simple actually nothing. It's not very complicated. You make it into difficult thing then okay. But what is the next one? According to that it is changing itself. If the next one is C3, C4, it will also convert into C3. If next one is C5, it will also convert into C5. If it is C1, C2, it will also convert itself into C1. That is what is happening. C3 followed by C1 becomes C1. C3 becomes C1. What do you mean by Dik? Dik means directions. Palaha means protector. Dik Palaha is protector of the direction. You must have heard, no? Dashadik Palakaha. Have you heard Dashadik Palakaha? The 10 protectors of 10 directions. Huh? East, West, North, South, then North, East, all the four corner directions and then up and up, down all these ten protectors dikpal tad kalaha tat kalaha tad that kalaha time that time tat kalaha tat kal tat kal ticket ticket train ticket tat kal that same how tat kal that time itself you have to book if you have pre-planned the journey, then that is not called Tatkal. Tatkal means I have to travel tomorrow, I have to book today. That is called Tatkal. The name is coming from Sanskrit only. Tatkalaha at that time itself. Alright. Tatkalaha. So here also you see C3 when followed by C1, that C3 will become C1. Tad, ta, tha, da, C3. The. The come back to ta. It is reverse process. Jalam Jashwante, from C1, C2, etc. it went to C3. Why? Because the next one was C3, C4. Now from C3 it is coming back to C1 when next one is C1, C2. Okay? That is what is happening. Don't worry about all other things. Udthapanam. Udthapanam. <laughs> Udthapanam. Udthapanam. Udthapanam means to, to, what do you say in English? Uh, to take up, to make something sit down, to take something up. Uthapana is to get up, basically. Those who follow, those who are Vaishnavas, follow the Ekadashi, etc. There are two important Ekadashis, if you, if you know. One is called as Ashadi Ekadashi and another is called as Kartiki Ekadashi. Hmm? Vithala, especially in Maharashtra, etc. also. For Vithala also these two Ekadashis are very important, Ashadi and Kartiki. That's why the that's why the Yatra etc. goes, Vari goes during that. 
आषाढ़ी एकादशी इज देव शयनी एकादशी इट इज सेट दैट भगवान महाविष्णु आफ्टर फाइट विथ मधु एंड कैटबा एट्सेट्रा स्लेप्ट एंड फोर मंथ्स ही स्लीप्स एंड देन गेट्स अप कार्तिकी एकादशी इज कॉल्ड एज उत्थापन एकादशी वेन भगवान गॉट अप सो आषाढ़ी कार्तिकी फोर मंथ्स अपार्ट उत्थापन मीन्स टू गेट अप देर विल बी उत्थापन पूजा ऑल्सो इन नवरात्रि टाइम एट्सेट्रा हाँ घटस्थापना एंड उत्थापन घटस्थापना इज हैपनिंग ऑन फर्स्ट डे ऑफ नवरात्रि उत्थापन विल हैपन ऑन द टेंथ डे वेन नवरात्रि इज ओवर वॉट इज हैपनिंग नो यू आर टेकिंग इट अप टेकिंग इट बैक स्थापन मीन्स पुटिंग इट डाउन उत्थापन मीन्स टेकिंग इट बैक वॉट इज द पॉइंट इयर द इज फॉलोड बाय थ इज सी थ्री थ इज सी टू इट इज इन द प्रीवियस वन सो द बिकम्स द उत्थापन अनुष्टुभ छंद अनुष्टुप छंद अनुष्टुप छंद प भ विच इज सी फोर वेन फॉलोड बाय सी टू दैट सी फोर बिकम्स सी वन बिकॉज इट इज फॉलोड बाय सी टू प्रीवियस वन अनुष्टुप छंद इज वॉट द मीटर दैट वी चैंट टूडे ऑल्सो वॉट श्लोका वी सॉ भगवद गीता मोस्ट ऑफ द श्लोकाज अनुष्टुप छंद रायण नाइंटी पर्सेंट ऑफ द श्लोकाज ऑफ वाल्मीकि रायण महाभारत मोस्ट ऑफ द श्लोकाज वेर एट 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 लेटर्स विल बी देर नो दैट इज कॉल्ड एज अनुष्टुप छंद राइट विराड पुरुष विराड पुरुष बिकम्स विराट पुरुष विराट पुरुष इज भगवान ग्लोबल कॉस्मिक फॉर्म ड When for, da is C4, uh, sorry C3. Da is C3 when followed by Purusha P is C1. Da changes to T, which is C1. Virat Purusha. Vipat Kala ha, Vipat Kala ha. Da plus K becomes T plus K. Vipat Vipat means difficulty, crisis. Vipat Kala ha means crisis situation, crisis time. All right. Now in the same way. Please do for all these things. Tadrug plus karma, asmad plus putra, ud plus patati, sampad plus kumara, kakud plus tha, etad plus parshvam. Please take two minutes and write. What is happening here? Please follow this. C one, C two, C three, C four. Followed by C1, C2, then that C1, C2, C3, C4 will convert itself into C1. All right, just finish it and then we will go ahead. Yes, done. Done. Let us see the answers. Tadrug plus karma, tadrug karma. G plus k, g becomes k. 
अस्मत प्लस पुत्र अस्मत पुत्र द बिकम्स द संपत कुमार व्हाट इज हॅपनिंग संपत दिस इज द आन्सर द बिकम्स द द बिकम्स द उदपतती उत्पतती ककुद स्थ ककुत्थ ककुत्थ ककुद प्लस थ ककुत्थ सम ऑफ यू मैट हैव सीन दिस भगवान श्रीराम वन नेम इज काकुत्थ काकुत्थ नॉट ककुत्थ काकुत्थ दिस इज ककुत्थ बट भगवान वन नेम इज काकुत्थ रिमेंबर इट कम्स इन रामरक्षास्त्रोत्र ऑल्सो काकुत्थ पुरुष पूर्ण काकुत्थ डिफरंट मीनिंग्स आर देर ओके काकुत्थ डिफरंट मीनिंग्स आर देर लेट अस नॉट गो देर अदरवाइज आई विल गेट हाँ एक प्लस पार्श्व एक पार्श्व बिहाइंड दिस और दिस इज बिहाइंड वॉट एवर वे यू वॉन्ट टू इंटरप्रिट अकॉर्डिंग टू द कॉन्टेक्स्ट एक मीन्स दिस पार्श्व मीन्स बिहाइंड ऑल राइट ऑल राइट चलो नेक्स्ट नाउ now see this carefully we have seen vargaksharas okay so far in this two this way columns rows correct so rows means what ka varga means what ka kha ga gha ng cha varga cha cha ja ja ya tavarga ट ठ ड ढ न तवर्ग त थ द ध न एंड पवर्ग इज प फ ब भ म नाउ सो फार द संधी रूल्स दैट वी सॉ वॉज बिट्वीन दिस करेक्ट इन द सेम वर्ग डिफरंट थिंग्स वर कमिंग इन प्लेस ऑफ डिफरंट थिंग्स सो इफ एनीथिंग इज फॉलोड बाय द सी थ्री सी फोर देन इट वॉज कमिंग टू सी थ्री If it was followed by by C5, it was coming to C5. It is followed by by C1, C2, it was coming to C1. So the horizontal movement was happening. That, let me give example. From K, something was getting converted into G. or ng or gh was getting converted into k like this movement was happening correct c1 c2 c3 c4 was getting converted into c3 or c5 or c1 etc it was moving like this now we are going to see this movement okay two main sutras are there for that we will be seeing now ha huh? but please understand now within the same varga changing the position is done now what we are going to change the varga itself so in that the first sutra is stosh chunash chuhu <laughs> very interesting sutra stosh chunash chuhu please repeat stosh chunash chuhu stosh chunash chuhu stosh chunash chuhu हा नाउ वॉट द सूत्र इज टेलिंग सकार तवर्ग यो हो स और तवर्ग 
shakara chavargabhyam yoge when it is in contact with sh and or chavarga shakara chavarga ustaha then it will get converted into this what the sutra is telling sakara tavarga yoho sa and tavarga tavarga is this tatha dadana shakara chavarga abhyam yoge ch ch j jh ny when sa or tavarga is in contact with sh or chavarga then sa will change to sh and tavarga will change to chavarga this conversion is happening okay understanding the difference till now what sutras we saw jalam jashonte yaronu nasikenu nasiko va khari cha what was happening ta was changing ta was changing to the the was changing to na the was changing to the etc here like this it was happening now like this it is going to happen the will change to ch the will change to ch in the same column they will move they are not going to go cross or anything but varga from the varga they will change to ch varga okay let us see when you see the examples you will understand that this is some sutra that you already know ha huh. one interesting thing that you have to note here is yoge is said not pare understand the difference between pare and yoge pare means when it comes after hey khari pare so the order was fixed what is going to be the purva rupa what is going to be the para rupa the order was fixed purva rupa means in sandhi whichever is the former first letter and para rupa is whichever is the second letter the order was fixed now here the order is not fixed means what whether sa is followed by sh or sh is followed by sa doesn't matter sa will change to sh whether sa is followed by chavarga or chavarga is followed by sa doesn't matter sa will change to sh whether tavarga is followed by sh or sh is followed by tavarga tavarga will change to chavarga in the same way whether tavarga is followed by chavarga or chavarga is followed by tavarga tavarga will change to chavarga that is what is happening so yoge means when they are in contact they can be in any order they should be in contact that is the whole point sa will change to sh tavarga will change to chavarga this is fixed okay what is first what is second does not matter sa can be in contact with chavarga uh, sorry sh or chavarga sa will change to sh tavarga can be in contact with sh or chavarga tavarga will change to chavarga let us see the examples we will understand many times we have seen this visarga specially when visarga comes after visarga we have not seen visarga sandhi yet so this is the step after visarga shishus shete shishushete sa changes to sh shishuhu small child shete sleeps a child sleeps manas manas pratipadika sakaranta napumsaka linga pratipadika chanchalam manas chanchalam how many time you have seen this manas chanchalam asthiram hmm? manas chanchalam ha sa is changing to sh what is happening here you see when sa is followed by sh sa changes to sh when sa is followed by ch varga then also sa is changing to sh now when ta is followed by ch varga sat plus chit satchit ta 
followed by ch t also changes to ch can you see that that is why satchit is becoming satchit satchit ananda satchidananda now you have understood how that satchidananda word is formed huh huh you see here you see here sat plus chit plus ananda what is happening here ta and cha two cha sat Chidananda. We also we can put. Now Sat plus Chit becoming Satchit by Stoshunashchuhu. Chit plus Ananda is becoming Chidananda. Ta is changing to the Jhalam Jashonte. See, C1 is changing to C3. In the same Varga, it is changing. Here, the Varga itself is changing. Stoshchunashchuhu and Jhalam Jashwante. Satchidananda becomes Sat Chit Ananda. Actually, right? I hope you have got this. Hmm? Next. Bhagavat plus Shaktihi, Bhagavat Shaktihi. Now hold this. This is not complete yet. Something more will happen. Okay? But at the moment, the Tavarga followed by Sha. Then Tavarga will change to Chavarga. C1, ta, ta is C1, no. C1 will change to C1 of Chavarga, that is Cha. Bhagavach Shakti. Okay. As I said, mark this. Something more is going to happen. Next. Sun plus Jayaha. No, 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 no. Carefully, carefully, carefully see. Sa followed by Sha. Sa followed by Chavarga. Tavarga followed by Chavarga, Tavarga followed by Sha. Front everything is over. Now we are coming other way around. It can be anything, anything followed by anything. That is where we are coming. Sun is Tavarga, C5. Jayaha is Chavarga, but different, not C1, C1 connecting. Sun plus Jayaha becomes Sanjayaha. C5. C5, but Varga is changed. Tatha dadhana cha cha jajanya. It has become C5 of Chavarga. Sanjaya uvacha, where is that Sanjaya coming? San plus Jayaha, Sanjayaha. Yaj plus Naha, Yajnaha, Yadnyaha actually. What is this Yadnyaha? This is Ja. Yaj. Plus Naha. J is Chavarga. Na is Tavarga. Yogi, they are in contact. What is happening? When Tavarga is in contact, when Tavarga is in contact with Chavarga, is in contact. Contact means order is not necessary. Hmm? Here also Tavarga is in contact with Chavarga. Tavarga will change to Chavarga. C5 only. In the same, they are not cross zigzag nothing, straight. So J plus Ny is written as Ny. Earlier also we have seen so many places. Ny is actually J plus Ny. Okay. Okay. That's why while writing it is written J plus Nya. All right. So Yaj plus Naha, same Stosh Chunashchuhu, Yadnyaha. Hmm? Next. Now this you do for yourself. Haris plus Shete. Haris is actually Harihi. By some Sandhi, it is becoming Sir. We will see that Sandhi later on when Visarga Sandhi will come. 
बट हरि प्लस चेते अन्यत प्लस च एतद प्लस ज्ञात्वा मृत प्लस शकटिक तपस प्लस चर्चा आ चर्या चर्या तपस प्लस चर्या प्रतिपत प्लस चंद्र प्रतिपत प्लस चंद्र टेक टू मिनिट्स एंड आंसर ऑल दिस व्हाट यू हैव टू डू व्हेन स इज इन कांटेक्ट विथ श और च वर्ग त वर्ग इज इन कांटेक्ट विथ च वर्ग देन स विल चेंज टू श त वर्ग विल चेंज टू च वर्ग इन द सेम ऑर्डर If it is C1 of the varga, it will go to C1 of the varga. C3 of the varga, C3 of the varga. C5 of the varga, C5 of the varga. In the same order, it will go. Right? Solve this, then we will see. राइट डन स चेंजेस टू श तवर्ग चेंजेस टू च वर्ग लेट अस सी द आंसर्स हरिस प्लस शेते हरिशेते टू श वन दिस स इज बिकमिंग श एंड वन ओरिजिनल श अन्यत प्लस च त चेंजेस टू च अन्य अन्य सो मेनी सच थिंग्स आर देयर जगत प्लस च जगत च स्यात प्लस च स्याच वेन यू रीड द स्क्रिप्चर्स वेन यू रीड द भाष्य कमेंट्री एट्सेट्रा यू विल सी दिस मेनी प्लेसेस वाई बिकॉज च इज यूज मेनी टाइम्स च मीन्स एंड राइट सो अन्य प्लस ज्ञात्वा एक ज्ञात्वा न्य इज एज इट इज द इज सी थ्री ऑफ द वर्ग एंड न्य इज एक्चुअली ज विच बिलॉंग्स टू च वर्ग सो द विल चेंज टू ज ए तज ज्ञातवा ए तज ज्ञातवा दिस ऑल्सो कम्स मेनी टाइम्स इन भगवदगीता ए तज ज्ञातवा समटाइम दिस ए ए तज ज्ञातवा बट करेक्ट प्रोनाउंसिएशन इज ए तज ज्ञातवा ज शूड कम ए तज ज्ञातवा मृत शकटिकम मृत शकटिकम अगेन लाइक दैट भगवत शक्ति ही मृत शकटिकम इट्स नॉट कंप्लीट येट कीप इट मृत शकटिकम कीप इट नेक्स्ट सूत्र वी विल सी व्हाट हैपन्स मोर बट मृत मीन्स डेड शकटिकम इज व्हाट इज शकटिकम कार्ट 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 लाइक बुलक कार्ट एट्सेट्रा इज नो दैट कार्ट इज कॉल्ड एज शकटिकम There is one very famous drama, no? Murcha Katikam. That is based on this only, the dead cart. Hmm. That story is there. Very interesting drama. Hmm. Tapas plus charya, tapas charya. Tapas like manas is sakaranta shabda. Hmm. 
सो तपस प्लस चर्या बिकम्स तपश्चर्य स इज चेंजिंग टू श एंड प्रतिपत प्लस चंद्र प्रतिपत चंद्र वॉट इज दिस प्रतिपत प्रतिपत इज प्रतिपत इज द फर्स्ट तिथि फर्स्ट डे ऑफ एनी मंथ और एनी फोर्ट नाइट इज कॉल्ड एज प्रतिपत चंद्र इज मून जस्ट कपल ऑफ डेज बैक शिवाजी महाराज जयंती वॉज देअर नो शिवाजी महाराज जयंती वॉज देअर हाँ देअर दैट हाँ मृत मृत शकटिकम ऑल्सो कैन मीन मृत मीन्स मिट्टी ऑल्सो क्ले ऑल्सो क्ले ऑल्सो मृद मृद अपी च चंदन मृद मृद मीन्स क्ले ऑल्सो सो द क्ले कार्ट ऑल्सो इज मीनिंग युअर राइट हाँ आई वॉज टेलिंग अबाउट शिवाजी महाराज जयंती हैपन रिसेंटली टू डेज बैक वॉज शिवाजी महाराज जयंती द ग्रेट किंग हु लिव्ड इन हिज इन हिज कॉइन कॉइन नो द कॉइन विच वॉज यूज इन इन शिवाजी महाराज टाइम हैज वन वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग श्लोक देर द श्लोक से प्रतिपच्चंद्र लेखे वर्धिष्णुर्विश्ववंदिता शाह सुनो शिव से मुद्रा भद्राय राजते वेरी फेमस यू मस्ट हैव सीन ऑल्सो इन शिवाजी महाराज यू नो दैट कॉइन इज शोन एंड दिस लाइन कम्स वेरी ब्यूटिफुल लाइन इज देयर इट से प्रतिपच्चंद्र लेखा इव लाइक द लाइक द प्रतिपच्चंद्र लाइक द फर्स्ट नाइट मून विच इज वेरी स्मॉल आफ्टर द अमावस्या विच कम्स विच इज वेरी स्मॉल वर्धिष्णुर विश्ववंदिता एंड इट गोज ऑन इंक्रीजिंग एवरी डे टिल पूर्णिमा मे यू आर ऑल्सो ग्लोरी गो ऑन इंक्रीजिंग दैट्स वॉट इज द प्रेयर फॉर शिवाजी महाराज शाह सुनो हो द सन ऑफ शाहजी योगी शिवाजी शिवस्य एषा मुद्रा दिस मुद्रा दिस कॉइन भद्रा ये राजते मे इट ब्रिंग प्रॉस्पिरिटी ओके वेरी ब्यूटिफुल प्रतिपच्चंद्र इट केम फ्रॉम देअर प्रतिपत प्लस चंद्र प्रतिपच चंद्र टू च त चेंजेस टू च वर्ग ऑल राइट सो दिस इज स्तो हो शुनाशु स्तो हो शुनाशु आई होप यू हैव अंडरस्टूड हाउ दिस स्तो हो इज स एंड टू स प्लस त वर्ग इज रिटर्न एज तू नो अर्लियर ऑल्सो वी हेव सीन तू मीन्स त वर्ग कू मीन्स क वर्ग चू मीन्स च वर्ग पू मीन्स प वर्ग सो दैट स्तू षष्टी विभक्ति स्तो हो शुना परे शुना योगे श प्लस चू श प्लस टू इज श एंड च वर्ग देन वॉट ऍपन शुहू द आन्सर इज दॅट स एंड त वर्ग चेंज टू श एंड च वर्ग स्तो हो शुना शुहू दॅट इज वॉट हॅपन्स लेट अस सी द एक्सटेन्शन वन सूत्र इज देअर हल संधि बट इट इज ओनली फॉर बही एंड इट इज विकल्प इट इज ऑप्शनल प्लीज नोट आदेश ऑफ कोर्स वॉट इज द सूत्र लेट अस सी शोटी प्लीज से शोटी 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 वॉट वॉट इज द सूत्र टेलिंग पदांता जय पर शस्य छ वा सैत अटी शह छह अटी शह छह अटी वॉट इज दिस नौ अरे देवा शह छह अटी ओके विसर्ग संधि वी हैव सो फार नॉट सीन But understand that this visarga is becoming sa. This visarga is becoming u, so it will be cho, ati. How this is happening, we have not seen yet. But the next what is happening, we have seen. When sa followed by chavarga, when sa is followed by chavarga, just the previous sutra, sto ho chunas chhu. What happens? स चेंजेस टू श एंड देन वेन ओ पदांत ओ 
is followed by a padanta o is followed by a then that a will get dropped ing of padanta dati long long back in ach sandhi we saw and that dropped a is shown by our graha shashchoti so you see the sutra itself is made up of sandhis okay that is how the sandhi rules are everything will get joined everywhere you will have to use sandhi shashchoti what is the sutra telling the sutra is telling vartika we will come to later when jaya jaya is followed by sh which is then followed by am then that sh will change to ch optionally wa this vartika is telling chatvam ami iti vacham when chatva is happening when it is changing to ch instead of ati you should say ami am should be there ayun riluk eong ayauch hayavarat up to here the sutra was telling but vartika is correcting it and saying no 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 you take it up to ma don't stop at hayavarat but go to learn yamanganam up to that you take so putting it jaya means c 1 2 3 4 shay sh am am is what swara antastha and c 5 swara antastha and c 5 then that sh will change to ch optionally let us go back to the example bhagavat plus shakti hi according to the previous to sutra ta changed to ch correct but now what the sutra says that ch which is followed by sh and the sh is followed by a shakti shakti is sh plus a then that sh may change to ch bhagavat shakti hi sh is changing ch is same by stoshunashu after stoshunashu in the extension sh is changing to ch सेम वे मृत शकटिकम मृच्छ मृच्छकटिकम हाउ दैट मृच्छकटिकम इज कमिंग फर्स्ट दैट त इज चेंजिंग टू च बाय स्तोह सुनाशु देन बाय दिस सूत्र श इज चेंजिंग टू छ मृच्छकटिकम यू रिमेंबर इन द प्रीवियस सूत्र वेन वी वर सिंग द एग्जाम्पल आई टोल्ड यू दोज टू थिंग्स यू मार्क बिकॉज समथिंग मोर इज हैपनिंग दिस इज वॉट इज हैपनिंग when followed by sh further that sh may change to ch of course there are some conditions same way tat shivah tat shivah tat shivah ta is changing to ch by stoh sunashu stoh sunashu now that sh will further may change to ch tat shivah हा इन इन द इन गुरुजीज कंपोजिशन तेजुमान जीज कंपोजिशन ऑफ न्यू इयर सॉन्ग विच इज वेरी फेमस ना न्यू इयर सॉन्ग इज फेमस बर्थडे सॉन्ग इज वेरी फेमस यू मस्ट हैव हर्ड जन्मदिन मिदम लाइक दैट क्षण प्रति क्षण यन नवम नवम तच्च सुंदरम सच्च तिव दैट तिव कम्स तत्शिव दैट इज ऑस्पिशियस तत्शिव तिव तिव ऑप्शन आर देर तत्श्लोक तच्श्लोक तच्श्लोक च प्लस छ प्लस ल वॉट इज दिस वाई दिस एग्जाम्पल इज गिवन बिकॉज यू सी हियर ल श इज फॉलोड बाय ल एंड ल इज इन दैट अट हायवर अट आफ्टर दैट कम्स लन सो द वार्तिक विथ चेंजेस अट टू अम हैज गॉट इम्पॉर्टन्स बिकॉज दिस अदरवाइज विल नॉट बिकम पॉसिबल तत् श्लोक बाय दैट बाय दैट वर्स तत् श्लोक स्तोह सुनाशु शश्छोटी
तच्छ्लोकेन एतच्छ्मश्रू 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 अगेन हियर सी फाइव श इज फॉलोड बाय सी फाइव व्हिच इज पार्ट ऑफ अम यमगणनम सो त फर्स्ट चेंज टू च स्तो हो शुनाश्चु हु बट दैट श विल मे चेंज टू छ एतच्छ्मश्रू ओके क्लियर हम्म सो वन सूत्र दैट वी हैव सीन टुडे इज खरीच रिमेंबर खरीच व्हाट डज इट डू गेट्स इट इन टू सी वन ओके देन वी सॉ स्तो हो शुनाश्चु हु एंड शोटी हम्म स्तो हो शुनाश्चु हु इज चेंजिंग द वर्ग and shashchoti is extension sh is changing to ch hmm? which is optional we kalpa sandhi va va is there you see va therefore optional either sto shunashu will only work or this can also further work all right so this much we have seen now one more sutra we have to see which is same as sto ho shunashu let us see that also very simple sutra same it does nothing other than what we have seen just the sutra we are going to chant we are not going to see the explanation we will see the explanation in the next class too much of saturation i understand stoho shunashchu was between tavarga and chavarga tavarga was getting converted into chavarga now shunashchu now tavarga and tavarga shuna shtuhu please repeat shunashchu Stunashtuhu. This is just after Stoho Stunashtuhu. Stoho comes same. Savarga, uh, sorry, Sakara Tavarga Yoho. Stuna Yoge, when in contact with Sh or Tavarga, Stuhu Syat. Hmm? So just, I will just point, show you what is happening. Sh or Tavarga. this is what is happening when sakara or tavarga is in contact with shakara or chavarga then sa changes to sh tavarga changes to chavarga whatever it in comes contact with it changes to that similarly if sakara or tavarga is in contact with shakara or tavarga then sa will change to sh tavarga will change to tavarga what stoho shunashu who did sakara tavarga changing to shakara tavarga same thing it does with sh and tavarga that's the only difference so whatever it in it comes in contact with it will change to that so sa comes in contact with sh sa will change to sh sa comes in contact with chavarga sa will change to chavarga tavarga comes in contact with ch tavarga will change itself to chavarga tavarga comes in contact with chavarga it will change into chavarga same way here sa will change to either shavarga or tavarga will change to tavarga when in contact with it okay examples etc we will see in the next class sandhi is not very very difficult actually when we go forward we, we will see also the easiest way to pronounce that is what sandhi is doing similar exa sim simple example that we saw now sat chit if it remains sat ta remains ta Difficult to pronounce. When it becomes ch, it is easy to pronounce. Satchit. Satchit is easy to pronounce than satchit. Satchit is easy to pronounce than satchit. Though the sandhi rule is for writing mainly, but it helps in pronunciation. We will see automatically those things we do. Shashoti we saw when first one is changing to ch, tavarga is changing to chavarga. then if the sh also changes to ch it will become easy tat shivam tat shivam it becomes difficult tat shivam becomes easy ch ch same place of pronunciation it will become easier for pronouncing so all sandhi rules are like that only made easy for pronunciation okay
so far for today this much is sufficient let us see the remaining one in the next class all right let us conclude om purnamada purnamidam purnat purnamudachyate purnasya purnamadaya purnameva avashishyate om shanti 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 hi harihi om shri gurubhyo namaha harihi om